Hola. Como estas? So today, we'll be talking about having sex. Go in the other room, man. Everywhere I go, you want to start doing shit. Do this shit in the other room. We'll be talking about having sex. Go in the other room and it's talk about It's an interesting topic. Go in the other room and talk about it. Okay. No, because you don't do that shit until I come in here and then you want to come in here. I don't, don't, don't no, even record videos around you. Cammy, no you don't. I just said I don't. Alright, so go in the other room. So we're talking about sex and trying to conceive. My legs look super big on this video. Anyways, my opinion with it is that um, there is none. <laughs> they don't. I wish it slow. I they don't that let involved. you do you nothing. Got that like I could have scored just now. IBF or IUI, like the week you're doing all those ultrasounds, or the week before your actual procedure. The week of your procedure, they don't let you do nothing. So I would say if you're planning on doing an IUI or IVF, get all the sex that you need to out of the way and just think that you might not be able to do it. It's better to go in with that thought to, than to go in just thinking life is going to be normal when it comes to intercourse because it won't. I mean, unless you got a different clinic that tells you different, but for us, we didn't get to do it as much as we wanted or... We had to do it on the schedule or we couldn't do it at all. Like one day I thought I was going to get me some next day, but then the doctor's office wrote me and they said, no more sex from this point on. What? You mean I got to wait? How long I got to wait? And then after, um, after your IVF egg retrieval, you have yeah, to I wait did. like... You got to wait like six weeks, I think, or at least until your next cycle comes on. But I think it's like six weeks of Hold on, bro. pelvic rest, meaning nothing in the vaginal canal. No tampons, no sex, no douching. If you douche, ladies don't douche. But yeah, so life of trying to conceive with procedures and science sucks if you like to have a lot of intercourse. It sucks, doesn't it, baby? Yeah. Yeah, because he likes to have intercourse. And I do, too. And it already sucks when you're trying to conceive and you got to be scheduled. So you can't, you just can't pop up and do it all the time where you can. But some people be saying do it every other day or make sure you do it every day. Or, or wait three days and then do it. During the inner, during the time of us trying to conceive, we tried all types of things. We did every other day, every day. What else have we done? Once a week. You name it, we've done it. Multiple times a day, done that. Nothing works. Not for us. But anyways, yeah. Not much intercourse when you're trying to conceive with science, with procedures like IUI and IVF. From what I know, it's just limited. It's not. I'm not saying that you can't, but at a certain point, they're probably going to tell you to cut it off and don't do it anymore for a while, and they'll give you a time frame. Well, they'll tell you when to, when they want you to do it also, because I think with IUI, I think with IUI they made us do it like the night of IUI. They told us to have intercourse, but like a week before the actual procedure, they said no because of course they want his sperm count to be built up. I guess. But then again, before egg retrieval, wasn't it weird? Like, didn't they make you, didn't they say, they made him give a sample prior to, they made him, they said, make sure you ejaculate at home before you come in to give your sample. That was really See, weird. you shouldn't have held on to that, bro. I think they made him do that, like, just. He shouldn't have held on to that. Two days or that something before he actually had to. I know it to. didn't hit him like that, but he still shouldn't have held on to that. I think they made him do his job at home like two or three days or something like that before they made him 
give his sample, which was used to fertilize my eggs. But yeah, just in case anybody was wondering, because I kind of wondered before I got into all of this. But now I know. I had to find out through um, actually. Oh. I couldn't find yes. um, <laughs> I couldn't find I couldn't find a video or nothing on it. So that's my input. Okay? Alright guys. But Bro, now we can bruh, we my, can now have all the intercourse we want. My dad quarterback was at a terrible ass game.